Hello, my beautiful Cancerian friends. How are you today? Welcome to the channel. We're getting ready to do your love reading, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus of Cancer. It can't and won't resonate with everyone. So let's look and see what your person feels about you, thinks about you, what they are likely to do in terms of action. So let's see. This is only about them and their feelings and their viewpoint. All right. So at the bottom of the deck, somebody spies on you. All right, so we have the Page of Swords energy, always seeking answers, the little spy of the internet. I'm going to try to put this over here so it's you can see it better. Okay, there we go. So the current energy your person has in the relationship at this time is the Libra Queen, being very, very unemotional, very balanced, thinking about what they want in their lives, and considering how this relationship fits into their life the five of swords energy is an energy that says that they feel as though this relationship has had its ups and downs five of swords energy is usually some nagging kind of fighting when you look at the picture this person doesn't want to hear what this person has to say but i would say that your person feels as though they've treated treated you badly because we have the crow pulling at the hair and we, hear, we see you in the background going, wait a minute, what are you doing? So, Cancer, I don't know what's happened with your friend here or your person, but it looks tough. Bringing you to the reading today, though, is the Justice card, trying to find balance. Your person is also trying to find balance in the situation. The Ace of Coins and then recent past, nice. An offer is being considered. This person has thought about you a lot lately. They want to make things right between the two of you. The Four of Pentacles says your person's holding back right now. The Four of Coins, you know, you can really see that she's in a very self-protective energy. He, she, it doesn't matter. But this, you know, your person's in a very self-protective mode. They do not want to share anything. And they're holding back at this time. In the near future, we have the beautiful Queen of Pentacles looking at the rest of the reading. I love it. So your person is feeling as though you could be the one. The Queen of Pentacles energy is very much the energy of Capricorn. They, Your person is really looking at you as someone of substance, someone who brings a lot to the table, someone that they think really they value you very highly. The Judgment card says that your person has to release something. The Two of Cups energy is indicating that they need to release. Well, we don't know what they need to release yet, but in the situation, how they view you as the Two of Cups, they do love you. Um, the Judgment card is, for some of you, you might have been, you might be in separation. This person might have been released you and is considering coming back. Um, so we're going to clarify that judgment card to see what is being released. They want a new beginning. Nice. Look at that. And Ten of Cups. Wow. That is Pisces energy, Aquarius energy, Cancer energy, and Scorpio energy. So when we look at judgment, everything, look at this card. The Ten of Cups is happily ever after. The Two of Cups is the Bride and Groom card. They want a new beginning. Oh, I like this reading. Okay, so let's clarify it and see what we have here. Okay, so what do we have for the clarification card for the Queen of Swords? Where is your person at with the Queen of Swords energy? Why are they thinking about our Cancerian friends in terms of very logical terms of the relationship? Six of Coins, your person wants to know if there's going to be equal give and take. So this person has some financial concerns. And I'm not saying that they're worried, but they want someone who earns um, who earns something similar to what they earn in a relationship. Okay, so now we have the Two of Swords. So the Two of Swords says, again, like I, I spoke earlier just a moment ago, your person is very closed off to the idea of hearing anything from the complaint department. They don't want to hear it. They just don't want to hear anything that sounds like holding them accountable. So I would just say that's a cautionary tale a bit, wouldn't you think? Okay, so why is the Justice card here? 
the king of cups energy so your person loves you your person loves you they haven't told you they've kept it quiet they know that it's unfair to you the fact that they've held back from you let's see what the offer is the page of wands okay so your person is going to throw caution to the winds good so if you've been in separation i see the two of you coming back together the ace of coins is a new offer coming out to you the page of wands is throwing caution to the winds why do we have this person so concerned over their pocketbook why is this person so worried about their pocketbook ace of wands they want to have a new venture they want to invest in something that's brand new they want a new passionate beginning with you so they're going to stop holding back is what i see but i also see them saving money for a business project purchasing a business doing something creative so i do feel as though they're holding back with their money has to do with business decisions but they also are certainly wanting to give more to you at least from a passionate standpoint <laughs> this sounded so much like a seventh grade movie and this is the fact of life children <laughs> sorry about that <laughs> all right so the queen of pentacles energy what do we have why do we have it here the queen of cups okay so when we get two queens right here we have three queens now in the reading it does show that your person wants to have someone who's very nurturing we get a very good description the queen of cups is the uh, counterpart for the king of cups so your person wants somebody who's emotional who's emotionally available um, they also want somebody who's balanced and they want somebody who has the power to have some career contribution to the relationship okay they could be for some of you this person will be dealing with more than just you but i wouldn't see for most of you that that's the case okay the judgment card why is this release card here what is this person releasing the hierophant okay so this person is giving up on the idea or releasing the idea of marriage but i'm seeing since i see hierophant marriage marriage i feel as though this person has not wanted to be married in the past and now they want it so they're giving up the idea they're releasing the idea of that you know they could actually be married they could they want stability they're very very stability driven here cancer queen of swords again queen okay so basically now your person's only looking at relationships that would culminate in a marriage. They're looking for somebody who is marriage quality person. The five of cups or the three of cups says that you want a reunion. Oh my gosh, this is great. Two of cups to the three of cups. I love the energy. And now we have the 10 of cups up here. So it looks like your person is returning. I feel as though you've been apart for a while. Four of Swords, after resting, your person wants a new beginning. It does look like you haven't spoken in a while. For many of you, that's about four or five months. But look at this beautiful Ten of Cups. The Ten of Cups has the Queen of Pentacles next to it. Again, that's a very strong nurturing energy. Somebody who's very grounded, Capricorn Queen. And we have the four of swords again this is so weird so it does look like the relationship needs to be healed that's a four of swords what one is this one? Oh, five of swords okay so what we're seeing here though is your person has they have an agenda and that agenda isn't necessarily one that's going to you know that that in which they're really thinking about what's good for you what i'm getting is that they're very concerned about what's good for them so i'm going to leave it there uh take it as it resonates oops we need to do the moonology oracle for you cancer a lot of love here but a lot of worry about financial stability but this person wants marriage with you they feel as though you could be the one all right what do you need to release okay bad attitudes 
right? At the end of the day, this person needs to release bad attitudes. Five of Swords energy, Four of Pentacles energy. So that is what I'm seeing for you, Cancer. It looks good overall. And uh, so leave comments below. It's been a pleasure and an honor to do the reading for you. Thank you.